Jaws Verstappen thinks Christian Horner will finish the 2024 Formula One season with Red Bull. Max Verstappen's father has backed the female employee who was suspended by Red Bull after Horner's allegations were not taken seriously. Joss is competing in a rallying race in Belgium this weekend. Therefore, he won't be at the Formula One Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. Welcome to F1 Opinion. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for more updates. I think it's too late for Christian to say, leave me alone. But he has the support of the tie owner, so I think he will stay for the rest of the season, he stated to the Daily Mail. I said it would bad if he stayed. It really isn't good for the team. This whole situation. Regarding the alleged altercation he had with Horner in Bahrain last week, Joss has come clean. That was earlier, on Friday before the race, he explained. Do you trust me? He asked me. We didn't argue. Instead, we were chatting with our hands as I promised to do all for your son. But on Friday, we did have an argument in the office, and I walked out, but in the trailer, he came up to me and said, Congratulations, good race. Joss stated, I sympathize with the woman with all that she went through, but we will see what happens. In reference to the Red Bull employee who has since been suspended, we shall see. But Red Bull seems to know what they are doing with her. However, I believe she should come out and observe what transpires. I'm not fully up to speed with what is happening with her, Jaws went on. But Max is being impacted by everything that is going on. He finished third in the first practice, and the only thing we hear about is Horner's predicament. Max, the car, his performance, and the race should have been the topics of conversation during Horner's recent news conference. But instead, it was all about him and his issues. I've already stated that I believe his presence will cause issues. In Saudi Arabia, Red Bull team principal Horner insisted that a boundary be drawn under the whole story to put an end to the inquiry. In response to the remarks, Joss said, I think it's a bit late for that now. That's good if that's what he wants, but I doubt it will work out. I don't want to talk about this too much since it will lead to issues. But the most important thing for me is that Max is happy. That's what counts for me. I just want him to be happy. At the second Formula One round of the 2024 season in Saudi Arabia, even the happiness of star driver Max has been called into doubt. Red Bull is currently looking into Helmut Marko, maybe because of reports that he was giving information to the press. Max made a suggestion that Marko's future might be connected to his own. My devotion to him is immense, and I have consistently conveyed this to all team members, including the upper echelons, that he plays a crucial role in my decision-making both now and in the future. Joss's remarks on Horner last week took the situation at Red Bull to a whole new level. The team is in danger of being torn apart, he stated while in Bahrain. Things cannot continue as they are. It is going to blow up. At the start of the Formula One season, he also accused Horner of playing the victim. However, Horner later enjoyed Chalam Uvidya, Red Bull's 51% shareholder, company in the paddock. Christian Horner has chastised rivals for allegedly attempting to take advantage of his Red Bull inquiry. Red Bull has now suspended the employee who lodged the complaint against Horner, following the team principal's exoneration from the charges against him, which he consistently refuted. Horner has been confident in his demand that the focus on his probe end at this weekend's Formula One Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. Furthermore, he maintained that it has made it possible for anonymous individuals to try to get an advantage over him. According to Horner, the leaks and the tension that has been created in the media are the only reasons this has garnered so much attention. This has in many ways been extremely difficult, especially for my family, as everything has been heavily concentrated in one area. And then after that, other people started looking to exploit it. Regrettably, Formula One is a highly competitive industry. It's clear that certain people are trying to get something from it. That may be our industry's less than ideal aspect. Horner said that he was not allowed to remark on Red Bull suspending his accuser. Any organization has a grievance procedure, which makes it a complex issue, according to Horner. Those involved maintain confidentiality regarding that process. Unfortunately, because of that confidentially and out of consideration for the business, and of course the other party, I'm not at liberty. Even though I would like to talk about it, I can't because of those confidentiality restrictions, because we're all bound by the same restrictions. Joss, the father of Max Verstappen, has been critical of Red Bull, adding to the turmoil. Following his probe, Joss had insisted that Horner resign from his position as head of the Formula One team. A week after he quarreled with Horner in Bahrain, Joss isn't in Saudi Arabia though, since he's competing in a pre-arranged rally car competition. What are your thoughts? 
Let us know in the comment down below and don't forget to like and subscribe for new upcoming videos of Formula One. Thanks for watching.